What's going on, buddy? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Life is Strange. Last one, we finally convinced Frank to give us all the info we needed without killing us, or us having to shoot him. All right, Nathan. What's this? Code numbers. Oh, so four. Good lord. Phone. Sim number. Is there any things in this? The dark room. Oh, they have selected those four. Eh? No. Nope. I don't this is know. not working. What are you again, Blackwell? I don't freaking know. Better look for any clues or numbers that could be his pen code. Number rights. It's GPA. There's a lot of numbers in here. She's saying. So let's try okay, this guy. There we go. Let's blow this code up and go home. Let's not go home. Let's just hang out. <clears throat> Investigation. Let's start hacking. Uh huh. 95, 35, 95, 35, 95, 35, 9, 9, 9, 95, 35. Okay, I thought I was going to actually be putting the code. Can I just, really? What is this freaking god dang? 95, why did I go the long way? Okay. Okay, Oops. oh, boy, there you go. Bad code. All right, try stupidest thing we possibly can. The pin number, which is one 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 one. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Of course not. Okay, let's try what every every teenage boy's phone number code is. Sixty nine, sixty nine. What? You have to rewind now. Enter puke. Can we just rewind time. <coughs> 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 Good God, excuse me, I'm getting, this is getting worse. Do you have any numbers in here? 7063. Good God, that's a lot of numbers. Um, 0058. All right, I guess let's just start doing that. 00. No, no. 58. Oops, bad code. All right, fine, screw you. What was the SIM card again? <gasps> Wait a minute. The, the pook. Cool. So actually, we could just use that instead. That's weird. Do you think 3988 and 3988 and 4436? 3988. Ah, I forget. 39. Oh, crap. 3988, right? Oops. Bad code. That was it, right? I'm not just being stoop here. 3988, okay. 4436. Uh huh. 4436. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Are you sure? Are you positively? 5431. Shit, what was it again? 31? You locked it, dumbass. 5431. Oops. 50. 5431. Okay, here we go. By here we go, I mean. Not here we go, because I done guffed it. 10 10 that'd be kind of dumb to be honest if it was his phone number oops bad code oops uh 19, 1995 would be kind of dumb what was birthday um i don't know 7063 let's try that out can I just... No, I just tried typing it in with my keyboard. Shit, what was it? I forget, because I got dang got distracted. 7063. 7063. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. We could just use the pook, I guess. I don't really want to. It's probably... Actually, maybe we have to do that. Oh... Oh one nine eight. 
Oh, one, nine, eight. You locked it, dumbass. You're a dumbass. All right, let's try this one more time. If not, we'll just have to. I was right down the pook. Seventy sixty three. I already tried that. Ten. No, I didn't actually. Did I? Oh yeah, I did try that. Okay. Eighty six oh three. Eighty six oh three. Eighty six oh three. Oops. Bad code. Alrighty then. Do I have any other numbers in this? October, August 29th, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. That'll be 0895. Oh, oh, oops. Oh, oh, eight. Oh, eight. 95. Five. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that. That would be kind of cool if that's what it was, though. Okay, what if backwards? <clears throat> no, that wouldn't really make sense, to be honest. Oh, wait. No, that. That, wait, I was doing that wrong. Um, 0829 is what it should be. Oh, oh. I forget what it is again. I like as soon as the thing is with me. As soon as I start, like I try to memorize the number, but as soon as I start seeing other numbers, I completely forget. 29, 0829. 0820. Nine. Hey, it worked. Cool. What's up? Need the G. Okay, cool, bitch. You sold me water, asshole. Calm down. Bring it to me. Bring it. Stay away, pigs on the beach. Okay, this was obviously um. Frank. Yes. This is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. You home? Got to party tonight. Home. On my way. Load the bowl. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Hey, I need to score tra score ASAP. I don't make house calls. You have a car. No time. Charge me double. Damn right. Half cash on you. No fucking around. Give me the address. I'll call you to the exact directions. In transit. Get the money out. Drug dealer drama. Yeah, bro. No shit. What do you need? Per... Peruvian flakes could do acid. You're paying night prices. Don't make me wait. Sorry for being a dick. Need more stuff. You home? Yes. Don't come. Fuck off. God, Nathan. Hey, need weed, etc. Now. Call yourself. You tweaking soon. Hook a brother up, please. Meet beach. Be cool this time. So it was you. Now I can officially <coughs> call you a psycho stalker. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything, or I'm coming for your ass. And I'll you sleep. No, Nathan. It's time for you to watch out. Hey, whore. Asshole. Feminazis will be exterminated. Watch out. Oh, this is him sending... Okay, to me. Is this right, right, right. father? That's brutal. Please do not contact me at work. I've told you this before, and being high is not an excuse anymore. This is a business, not just a hobby. You want me to treat you like an adult who can get things done on his own? Impress me. I'd like nothing more than to be proud of you. I'm not there yet. <laughs> That's hilarious. His daddy don't love him. From Nathan. Ah, great to fucking die, bitches. You, f you fuck up my dorm door. I kill your scholarship. Great typing, asshole. Good luck with that, asshole. Take a breath, Max. Go through all this data and you can't oh find out God. where Nathan took Kate after the party. <sighs> Supposed to do this. Three out of three. Okay, so in other words, one from each of these. What day was? The, I don't. Oh wait, 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 wait. This right here. So, this infamous party was the fourth. October fourth. That's January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October. That's ten o four. Ten o seven. 1007 1004 1004 Let me load the bowl. So it's got to be these ones. But which one? It's got to be this one where I got it delivered, right? Hey, it's great SAP. 
Um, Mikael Skulls, you have a car, no time, charge me double, damn right. Okay, I'll give you the exact and trying to get the money out. It's gotta be that one. Uh huh. 1004. Blackwell. Five five grams speed, five grams cocaine. So it's gotta be it there. And finally Is Frank meeting Nathan at the junkyard. Uh, ten four, ten four. That beach is like Frank's main office. <laughs> Apparently, Somebody is stocking up on gas. Why? Ten four. Oh, nine fifty four. What time was this? No, that can't be right. Five forty p.m. Wait, I think I chose the wrong one. Um, 10, 4, 11 p.m. There we go. Boondocks. 5 grams GHP. That's got to be it, actually. I don't know what the hell GHP is, but whatever it is, messed up, Kate. Okay, what time was it? 11 p.m. 11 p.m. No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. So, he could be hiding clues there, too. 10, 4, 11 no 10-4 here, is there? No, there's 10-4. Nothing at 11. So that can't be it. Nope. Uh, 10-4. I know Nathan wasn't looking for Bigfoot in the forest. What was he doing? Not much out there. 10-4, 10, 10. Oh, oh. Where is this? That was this one, right? Yes, it was. It's probably this one, then. Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. Poor rich Nathan. 10-4. Okay. If Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. <laughs> you don't say. It should be, should be golden. Chloe, this is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here. This is cool. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Some shitty old barn. Yeah, hey, exactly. Where do the drug deals take Let's place? Keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. How the hell would you figure that out, even? Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. Oh, shocked. Prescott. Should we call the police? No, we should go Fuck check it that. out. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody, except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say Gotta that. Gotta be careful. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. No, it's that's a horrible idea. Else, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. Oh, I have I the power. Like this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. So what happened? But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. <laughs> sir, yes, sir! Like, we keep everything we have on us when we travel through time. What would happen if we, like, hugged Chloe or held her hand or something? Would she, would she still reverse in time, you know? Here we go. No trespassing. The good old Shit, Prescott barn. Scary. I know, but we're here. Let's go find the best way in. Chirp, chirp. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. That's weird. Then we need to get in that barn. Weird. Chloe is so damn fearless. <laughs> Where does that come from? Only from my ability to freaking break time. I'm doing it. Watch us. No trespassing. Or do. I'm just a sign, not a cop. I didn't realize that being the shit out of someone would bruise my fists. Yep, that is the thing that happens. Of course, I bruised his face worse. Hey, he had that coming. The whole fight was so insane. 
Yes, it was so. How are you doing? Amped up. I want to do it again. Unless I had you. You paid your hero dues. Now we just need costumes. Speaking of which, I hope you're coming to the party tonight so we can celebrate. I'll let you know. Promise. Cool. Now I have to get back to striking super poses. Well, that was a nice little pause in the action here. Yeah, it is a car. Watson, we can safely assume that this ancient vehicle is not our suspect. What was that? What's on behind? Oh, okay, that's a deserted house. Ooh, that's a cool looking house. But then I saw the roof and, you know, it's like a propane tank. Propane and propane accessories. Any bodies in here? Chloe, I found the front door. Come on. Wow. Say that padlock. He did not do a good job at. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. You know. I feel like you guys should, like, park the truck this somewhere hidden. Way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. Oh, Come wow. On, Pictures. Oh, boy. What are we about hey, to find? This old chest. Yeah, I was looking at that, too, actually. No, no dead animal. bodies. There's shit. a truck right outside. Ancient jackpot. Old shit. No, uh, look closer. New shit. Harry Aaron Prescott and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescotts bring bomb shelter boom to town. My scrapbook. You search for more clues, and I'll scope out the area. Let us do that. I'm glad you're going through all that paperwork, and I'm not. A little bit sick. Oh no. Chloe would make a great okay. detective too. Entrance. Uh, let's not leave. Yeah. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Well, these pictures got to be somewhat recent because uh, this barn is in pretty rough shape. That would have been wet and destroyed long, long ago. Unless this game just you know, doesn't really care about that. A good old tractor. This tractor has paid its dues. <coughs> Scusé. Tracks. Okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out here. But there must be. Hello, spoopy crate. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. Uh, Martin Lewis Prescott, Prescott Ranch, Cardia Bay, Oregon. Dearest Mr. Linden, I'm writing regards to your outstanding debt, so you have chosen to ignore the Prescotts may not be established business gentlemen, but we are businessmen and expect your due. We take your silence as a personal insult and thus dedicate our family name to making, sh making you pay your debt with 10% interest plus a written apology if these conditions are not met by the end of the end of... And... By the end, if the day, July 24th, in the year of our Lord, 1903. Weird. Uh, rest assured that we will make your life a living hell. Okay, as regards to MLP. So again, interesting. How all this survived unprotected in an open box in a falling apart barn where it's completely exposed to the elements. And rodents. Wow, lots and lots of rodents. Talk about home on the range. Here, home on the range. Will the deer and the antelope destroy? I'm sorry, I don't know. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. Yay! El weapon. What is that? A hook? Huh. These hooks are used to lift haystacks. Yeah. I saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. Just rotting wood. Rachel Amber! Ah! Rachel Amber zombies! Ah! There's gonna be another room, I feel. I feel it. Ah, oh, the good old days. Eggs, bacon, sugar, coffee. The hell? Cocaine? Cocaine? I, I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's the thing you just used to be able to buy a long time ago, which is weird, but, uh. Apparently, it was never used to be like a joke. So many haystacks, so few needles. Oh, you silly. I found nothing, Chloe. Do you got something for me? No? Is there something else I'm missing here? Well, I guess we're going to call it an episode here. In the next one, we'll figure out what the hell's going on. Ooh, what's this? <coughs> no way does Rusty <coughs> to activate these ropes with pulleys. Nope. Um. <coughs> yeah. Grounds. Oh, we can search the ground here. 
nothing here. Oh, uh, I'm expecting a trap door or something in a second. I thought there was gonna be, an, yeah, there, there's definitely gonna be like another room in here or something. Oh, trap door. There we go. What is this? It's totally brand new. I heard noises what? in the background and I thought uh, it was someone inside there for a second, but no, it's not. Hello, black room. Thanks for watching, everyone. Um, so I call you Rachel Wood, hey, hey, oh, Frank. The time is turning. Wow, that does not space out properly. This is the moment where all clues come together and we find... Find a have a location outside of town that may lead straight to Rachel Amber and beyond. After everything that happened with Frank, I had to convince Chloe to keep going forward with me since I do feel we're at the end of the road. Hopefully we we hopefully not to end of the world. But whatever anger Chloe has inside of her that makes her so self destructive is matched by her balls and bravery. Yes, Chloe has gotten me nearly killed, but I know she would die for me. I can't forget I put her in a wheelchair to slowly die in another reality. And Chloe is more focused now than I than before. I told her that we have to keep moving forward no matter what and we have and I couldn't find Rachel on my own. That was enough. Uh, now it's time to shine a light in the dark room. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you next time. Bye.